today guys as you can see we've got episode number three of wwe 2k19 we are carrying right off where the last episode finished we did have an awesome match against cole quinn in the last episode if you haven't seen it pause this now Go back and watch it. It's well worth a watch, I think. It's a long watch. I do apologise for that. It took me a bit longer than what I would have liked to get past that match. But I did get past it. And here we are now. We've got a couple of options. We can either speak to Mr. Baron Blade. Or, as we found out at the end of the last episode, we are headed down to sunny Mexico. So, I think I'm going to speak to Baron Blade first. And then we're going to head down to Mexico. This is huge that we're already expanding internationally. Our plan to take it to Triple H and WWE is working faster than expected. I don't think we're going to be taking it to Triple H and WWE anytime soon, mate. I don't think they really care about us. And I, and I have to admit, I doubted you a little bit when you first told me about all this. I'm not sure where that voice come from. But so far, it's all coming together like you said it would. See? You just needed to trust me. Hmm, I still don't. I know, so I've got any tips about wrestling in Mexico? Study up on some Lucha Libre footage. As you know, it's a completely different style. And if you accidentally drink the water there, make sure you wear brown tights. Yeah, I ain't gonna be drinking no water down in Mexico. I've heard bad things. And now, here we go. Down to Mexico for some Lucha Libre action. A few days later. Wakey, wakey. Oh, somebody's sleepy. We're having an earthquake? No, no, no. I'm just playing the wrestler wake up game, man. Relax. You might want to choose a less terrifying wrestler name next time. Yeah, noted. We made it. Already? Who? Really didn't seem like we were driving two days. Gee, I wonder why. It's because you've been asleep the entire two days. Hey. So, I need sounds to like me. Genius promoter rest. Uh huh. Of course you do. How do you say I need a shower in Spanish? Necesita un shower? I don't know. I don't hmm? know. Educational shower. and enjoyable. You're a lot of help. Did you see that? What? That mask guy who attacked me, he's here. I just saw him. I think you're seeing things from being awake for so long. No, I saw him. I'm telling you that was him. How about you get some rest before your big match tonight? We need to keep all our momentum going. Can't have any setbacks due to hallucinations yet. That wasn't a hallucination. <laughs> right. No, it wasn't. Wait, stop, pull over! What, what is it? You pull over. No, I want to try some authentic Mexican street corn. Oh, you muppet. Yes, she is. Oh, here we are with my funky music. Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Bad Jokes has arrived in Mexico for my big match here in some outside arena where you can buy food or, or it's good to be able to buy food near the ring. Maybe if I get hungry during the match, you never know. Might pick up a snack. And we've, we've got multicolored ropes. Always good to have multicolored ropes. And yep, just going to skip that. And we're apparently coming out of some sort of army tent for the entrance. And that's quite possibly the worst mask I've ever seen in wrestling. I think he picked that up in the joke shop. And not a very good joke shop. You could even say a bad joke shop. Maybe I'm making money on the side selling masks. Who knows? Oh, he's, he's a flag for a fat dude, isn't he? I don't even think I could do that. So... Quite impressive man there. Eh? You can buy t-shirts as well. Dude, this promotion where we are got, got, got it all going on, didn't they? Now let's go quickly into the first match. Oh, as I've got caught. I was not expecting that. And big backbreaker early. And so I've got to get El Mago to red health and hit him with a strike while in the ring. Be able to do anything would be quite nice. And then, oh... Punishing move to the knee. This would be quite embarrassing if I can't get past this one. And there we go. Early kick out. Here we go. Bad jokes at last. Coming back at him. 
And now, Esta lucha ha sido oh, nice Russian leg sweep. We are going all international here, using Russian moves in Mexico as an American, or as an Englishman even. And now, I was whip him into the ropes. And nope, nothing happens there. Oh, what was that? That was athletic. And we've got Mexican commentary. That's quite cool. Oh, reverse that. Nicely done and nice neck breaker. Oh, another elbow. And drop kick. Now going back up to the middle rope again. Come on, fella, get up. This ain't no time to be having a sit down. Ah, well, that was awful. That was more like what I would do in a wrestling ring. Oh, nice canter. And oh, what are we doing here? Oh, that was original. That was a very nice neck breaker. Oh, good counter there from Al Mago. Oh, I managed to escape that. Oh, oh, look at that. All around the world. And now, oh, he's got me outside the ring. And now top rope. He's waiting for me to get up. Going with Mexico, but they're chanting in, uh, or counting in, in English. Not quite sure what's happening there. Payback, yeah, you've already told me about all this. Yep, I know all about all this. Dang. Oh, good counter there. And now just waiting for him to get back in the ring. I have already got a finisher from somewhere, not quite sure where, but I'll take that. Nope. I think they just said something about Braun Strowman. I think I picked that up. Oh, no, oh, he's kicking the hell out of my legs. Oh, good how a Karana there from the man. We need to get back into this. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, just about kicked out. I was nervy there, people. And now, oh, here we go. I don't want him to tap out yet, but hopefully we'll just get him into the red. And there we go. Oh. No. Come on, no, oh, suplex. Oh, he's going for the Eddie. We are in Mexico, so it is only right that we go for the three amigos. El Mago paying his respects to Eddie Galelo. Oh. Okay, what have I got to do here? Okay, it would be nice if I had some sort of buttons to press. Oh, oh, that's not gone well, and he's busted me open. I think that's me nose he's broken. And again, again, we've got him in this, but again, don't want to tap out just yet. Oh. Yes, please stop talking about please stop talking about my match with Braun Strowman. That was a three second embarrassment. And here we go, finally. 
getting him into the corner and clothesline him in. Very old. Who's this guy? Oh, it's the guy who attacked me. Get him out of the ring. Get him out of the ring before I do something to him. Terrible. Que lastima que esta lucha tremenda termina así. That's a better mask. He's not been buying that from Bad Joke Shop, has he? Well, okay. That's the end of that match. No idea why it ended there, but it did. Now, do you believe me? I should hope so. He's right in front of him. Look, I don't know why you're doing this, but I am not going to let you try to ruin my career ever again. I still think Baron Blade has something to do with this. Oh, we're unmasking him. Who the hell are you? Soy un fan y solo quería atención. Perdóname, por favor. What's he saying? Did he admit to everything? <sighs> no. He's a fan. He's just craving attention. He's a copycat. Of course he didn't. Of course he didn't admit to everything because it's you that did it, wasn't it, mate? Let him go. <laughs> Gracias, señor. Oye, puedo tener un autógrafo? No, you cannot. You ruined my match, my big match down in Mexico. You can get lost, son. Not tonight, buddy. Well, your big Mexico debut didn't go quite as planned, but the match was still great up until the end. Any publicity is good publicity, right? You've still got the buzz going. I guess. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take a shower. Yeah, I think I need it after that. I mean, ducha. <laughs> I looked it up. Of course you did. Still do not trust you at all. A few weeks later. Mm, it looks so like we've got a cage. This is what you had to build for our big rematch, right? What is it, a tetanus tornado match? Yep. <laughs> That's beauty, don't you think? I think it's a still cage. I'd say it's more beast than beauty. Well, its official name is the Scrap Trap. Not only are we going to have our biggest streaming audience yet, we're doing it in one of WWE's most iconic venues. It's like we're Triple invading H's their territory. Your ass. Man, I wish I could see the look on Triple H's face when he sees this. I don't think Where he's going to be impressed. Where did even come from? Where did you dig this up? All over. Might anyone who's just seen a steel cage. If anybody else seen anything different, let me know down below. That section is from WCW's Triple Cage. That is from an ECW cage. And I believe that side used to be an old prison fence. <laughs> Pretty neat, huh? Okay, so it's a mixed match of cages. I think a better name would mm. be Death Trap. This violates every health code known to mankind. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if it comes from ECW, it definitely does. Oh, okay, well, who do I want to talk to now? Uh, let's talk to Cole Quinn. See what he's got to say for himself. I saw what happened in Mexico. Too bad some idiot had to go and ruin a great match. Oh, no, tell me about it. It's okay, well, it's not okay, but whatever. Any publicity is good publicity, if you say so. <laughs> yes, Baron. I know. I am. I am. I am sounding like Baron. It's not on. So how was Japan? Japan was great. I was free to be myself, and the fans really respected that. So I'm gonna try that from now on here in the U.S. Sounds like a plan. No more black hole coal. Really? No, blooming awful. <laughs> yeah. Assuming I survived the scrap trap tonight. I should hope you will. I should hope I do as well, to be honest. Alright, now let's have a chat with the evil genius. Oh, that's a question that doesn't even need answering, does it? It's blatantly not. Oh, but that's the appeal of it. And you know what I always say? The appeal is not being safe. Okay. Why are you trying to be Eric Bischoff? You are not Eric Bischoff, mate. I do always say that, but that's not the catchphrase I was referring to. 
Oh, this ain't ballet. Yes, that's the one. Well, I don't think you come up with that one either, mate, did you? It's just that things are going really well for us. I mean, look where we are. In just, in just a couple of months, we've gone from a high school to a famous WWE venue. Don't, don't want to get injured. Fine. Have you had a tetanus shot recently? Not recently, mate. Oh, I've, been, I've been too busy trying to build up your stupid promotion. So now, here we go. Big, big cage match. Oh, is this supposed to be the Hammerstein Ballroom? This looks very Hammerstein Ballroom-ish. Which, if it is, is quite cool. And here we go. Back again with the decent, awesome music. Might be the last time I hear this for a while. If I get injured in this stupid, dangerous mix match of cages. Why on earth would you want something from the WCW Triple Cage? I have no idea. And here comes no gimmick needed Cole Quinn. Because apparently he's now going to start being himself. And let's get this cage down here. And all I've got to do is win. I like that. I can focus a bit more without having to do stupid little extra bits. And now double underhook suplex. And now can I throw him into the cage? Nope, he reverses. And I reverse that. Having some issues with our pay-per-view stream. It might even be down completely. If anyone can still hear And good bulldog. Trying to find out what's going on. The streaming service is down. Why am I not socked at all about that? And nice suplex there. And oh, going for something there, but he gets the leg sweep. And kick out after one. Oh, forehead smash. And now... Oh, nicely done. After the pay per view, be sure to now, check good out the website where you can purchase all kinds of BCW swag, including my new favorite item, a BCW lunchbox, which is an homage to when our locker room was in an actual school cafeteria. Mm, we're now planning selling lunchboxes. I'll be sure to get down there straight after this match. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's nice. Now, oh, nice punishing move to the back of his head. Again, as Vince McMahon would say, what a manoeuvre. And oh, clothesline to the back of me, well, to me back. And yes, kick out early doors. Oh, is he going to drag me into the cage? No, he's not. I escaped that rather easily. The fact that we're broadcasting from the former home of Monday Night Raw shows that PCW yeah. is making huge strides. Oh. We couldn't have done it without your support. Seriously, this venue wasn't cheap. It cost about 50 high school gyms. 50 high school gyms to get this place? I didn't know high school gyms was a unit of currency these days, but apparently it is. Second ever streaming pay-per-view live from WWE. No, no. There we go. Kick out early doors. And oh, good clothesline. And oh, no, I don't, don't want to escape. And no, I've got to win by pinfall. Okay, well anyway. Uh, um, just for future reference, use L to move long legs onto the top of the steel cage. You can attack a climbing opponent. Yep. Okay. And yep, that all seems Recently pretty much Japan how it used to be. BCW is truly becoming a phenomenon around the window. And yeah, oh, he gets his back down. No. And there we go, back down. A nice arm drag. Buzz versus Cole Quinn in the first ever Scrap Trap match. 
No. If you think this thing looks dangerous, that Ooh. Is what it is. No, no. What? There we go. They shut it down? Damn it! Triple H. It had to be. These two guys are out here killing each other, and thanks to him, no one's seeing it. No, I don't want to stop the match. There's still the live crowd here, and maybe we can release the video. Oh, the streaming service is officially down. This is not going well for Mr. Blade. Oh, come on. No. Oh, don't throw me into the cage. That's just mean. That's just awful. Oh. Oh, and into the cage again. Oh, good counter there. For our ever oh, missed that. Live from WWE's old stomping grounds. And out again. Getting better with this pinfall game now. After the pay -per -view, be sure to oh, check out Irish whip. He drops down. And oh, tries to go for the belly to belly. But I shut that idea down. Item, a BCW lunchbox, which is an As Baron Blade really wants to sell that lunchbox. Oh, going for the knee to the face. Sitting into the corner, Raven esque. And out again. Come on, fella, get up. In honor of tonight's oh, knee to the back. In the first three rows were given free nice. <laughs> oh. No, 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 no. Please don't throw me into the cage. Thank you. Oh, I switch just into the other corner. Oh, smash to the face. We are getting our ass whooped right about now. Being able to get up and do me finisher would be quite nice. Headbutt. Damn it. Triple edge. It had to be. These two guys are out here killing each other. And thanks to him, no one's seen it. No, I don't want to stop the match. There's still the line. No, we're not stopping the match. Or oh, hopefully I can escape from this, and I can. Punch to the face. That's the best way to break up any move. If you can hear me phone going off, I do apologise. Oh. And now, oh, I don't think this is going to last much longer. Two and Rolos. Take two. We're going to be doing that one again, people. Objective field. Rolos. This is not going to take as long as what the other one did, I promise. Here we go again. This all feels rather familiar. But this time we are going to do better. No, I don't want to... Nope. I just want to do a move off the top rope, but apparently I'm not allowed. So we get Germans for our efforts. Yes, good move. And I just cannot get near him. Now, what we're going for, double underhook. And yes, just feel all the emotion from the crowd, mate. Completely. Oh, you still hear this. We apologize, and we're trying to find out what's going on. No, no, what's he doing here? Oh, knee to the arm. I think after this match, when I do get past it, I am going to be improving my guy's stats. And here we go. That's nice. Other wrestling promotions, and because it rides. 
And now he's against the ropes. Can I throw him into the cage? No, I don't. But oh, very, very nice. Just working on his back. Oh. No, come on. That's not going to beat me, mate. Oh. Come on, get this. Get back up, mate. Apparently, we're having some issues with our pay per view stream. It might even be down completely. If anyone can still hear this, we apologize, and we're trying to find out what's going on. And again, another German. And now going for the pin. Is this going to do it? One. one, just a one count. Joining us tonight for our second ever streaming pay-per-view. Live from WWE's old stomping grounds. Nice. This is looking a bit more like it. Oh, not there. It's not. Oh, nice drop kick. And now pick him up. And now, here we go. Suplex into the backbreaker. And what we're going for? Going for the inverted DDT. That should be it. One. Two. Ah. Oh. Not quite. Check out our new website where you can purchase all. No, no, stupid. Stop climbing the ropes. Ah, nice little move there. Cole Quinn might be getting back into this now. Which is not what we want. Oh, he's just demolishing us there. Now, yes, good counter. And now working on the arm. And the stream is down once again. Bound Blade not having any luck with these streams, is he, people? Oh. Yes, there we go. Oh, kick to the back. Well, we're not broadcasting. Shut up, Baron Blade. The stream's down, mate. And now, is that going to be enough? One, two, ah. Oh. Come on. No. Okay, force of habit. I don't think Triple H has any time to be shutting down in that streams, fella. Damn it. And now, can we get the finisher going again? Yes, we do. This surely, at the second time of asking, should be enough. Look at that, planted him perfectly. And now, yes, come on. One, two, three, get in. At last, second time of asking, we got the job done. Then this video is about half hour long now. So I'm gonna just see if there's any more story after this and then just possibly leave it there, I think. Guys, that truly topped anything you've ever done before. But I'm afraid I got some bad news. Yeah, nobody saw it because you're rubbish. Our pay per view stream went down in the middle of your match. No one watching online got to see how it ended. Because you Is are useless. Something would happen. No, we were taken down intentionally by Triple H. Triple H? No, he wasn't. How could he even do that? I'm not believing a word of this. WWE's lawyers are claiming they have exclusive rights oh, okay, to broadcast from this venue. 
Damn well, it. prove me wrong then. And now we're getting flooded with refund requests. Don't think you're getting any bonus checks for this show, guys. I'm sorry. Does either of what? you know if you can return slightly used jet skis? I might have jumped the gun on purchasing a couple. You muppet. We'll circle back to that later. First, Triple H unfairly pulls my contract from defending myself from an attack, and now he's trying to sabotage our business? We have to strike back. They have a yes, team of do. lawyers and an endless supply of cash. You guys just competed in a cage made from an old prison fence. What could we possibly do to them? Well, well I'm sure you you've got an idea. It was like we're invading their territory, right? So, what if we actually did that? What do you Ooh. mean? I mean, we hit Triple H exactly where it hurts the most by selling him used jet skis. That's how you do it. That's how you said take it to Triple H. NXT, totally on the same page as you, Buzz. I don't know about this, guys. It seems risky. Why? Well, you'd want to be getting us all annoyed at him. So what do we have to lose, right? And this is what you wanted, Baron. You wanted this. Yeah. You said it yourself. Our plan. You want to stick, stick it to him? Triple so why don't we do it? So what do you say? I think we're gonna need a really big stick. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, it is. Okay. So that's gonna be in the next episode. If you guys have enjoyed this one, give it a massive thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel for more WWE 2K19 My Career Mode content. I've got FM19 content as well, Football Manager 19, for those of you who aren't, who aren't aware of it. And we've got Pro Evo 2019 as well. Subscribe for all that good stuff. I am Bad Jokes Gaming. Follow me on Twitter at Bad Jokes Gaming. And yep, one thing left to say, I am Bad Jokes. I am out.